I love everything vintage. I hunt thrift stores, garage sales, auctions and more for vintage items, furniture to refinish, pieces to repurpose, or just things I see value in to flip. Occasionally I keep unique items I just can't live without. I'm Original Vintage 71. Follow me on my thrifting and DIY <laughs> adventures. We're having a good time. Don't <laughs>336 took us a long time to get here. okay we have coffee <laughs> we may be oh up a little goodness. later tonight wait Don't... wait till you taste that <laughs> we might be up late tonight because we don't drink coffee at night okay in the evening we'll be good to go at the thrift store <laughs> we will be good to go for sure absolutely <laughs> We'll be good to go and then we'll crash hard. Yeah, we'll be like in the cart. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get there. The stopping. I want a coffee. I'm excited about the coffee, but we're taking longer to get there. Once I, I feel like once I get going to a thrift store and I, I'm getting out of the parking lot, it's like I gotta, I gotta get in there before somebody gets the good stuff, but yet it really doesn't matter. No. Cause there's always stuff coming out. Oh yeah. <laughs> It's this, it's this mental thing you get in your head when you go thrifting. You don't want to miss out on the good stuff. Got $20, $20 in, in my pocket. pocket. Your grandma's clothes, I look incredible. <laughs> <laughs> this is the old Rona. Look at it, it's a goodwill that I didn't even know about. This is the old Rona. I used to come oh, here and get I'm uh, so supplies. excited. Coffee, we're ready to go. Look at the fancy doors. Oh, it looks incredibly busy here. Oh my lord. There's nobody down this aisle really, so we're going to start here. What do we have on this aisle? Oh, oh look at this. That's quite the platter with the divided tray. It's pretty heavy. What's that? I like the lid, the color of the lid. I think it's scratched, whatever it is. Yes, it has a scratch. Ooh, where can I put you so I can look at you? Oh, that's kind of pretty on the inside. Ah, except it's got a scratch. So we're just gonna leave it there. I was noticing this Indiana glass divided platter and the ruby red was just a little too worn and for $25 I didn't think there was enough room. Look at this goose tray. That's interesting. What do you think of this goose tray? What is going on in the center of it? Is it broken? I don't know. Too bad that has a crack because I kind of like that one. It's 
kind of pretty. Oh, well, how much do they want for this little guy? What's your price? Let's just take the lid off and put it carefully over there. I want 15 for that. That's about how much I could probably get for it. Maybe, maybe 20, 20 and 25. You did not just drink that all. I did. You just got here. That's so good. Did you guzzle it? It's good. It's a light. Oh, uh, she's kind of cute. With a little tiny light. $8.50. Mm. This is kind of a cute little tray. $9.50. It's got a silver bottom on it. I don't know if somebody glued that on or it came like that. It's like someone glued that. What else? Yeah, cool. Let's see. The little light. Century sales. Little light for a little girl's room? Huh. What do we got here? Oh. Got a beard and fancy hair like you? No? Hype? Well, you're not hype, but. Yeah. Well, you're gonna be because you just drank all that coffee. <laughs> kind of like this picture frame, not necessarily the inside of it, but the frame's kind of cool with the, the rulers. There's a big green grape dish down here. So it goes for Oh, it's chipped. Right there. Right. Oh, that green bowl is chipped. Some more corn. Oh, look at this old. Uh, more corn? No, no more corn. You sure? There's four more. <laughs> no, family. old kettle. They're funny. Oh, that shit they want for this little guy. $20.50. I sell these for about $12, $15. So that one's not coming with me. I've had these before. I have a harder time selling them. What's this? What piece? Denby. Handcrafted daybreak. It's kind of a pretty little bowl. 1550 though. Hmm. I do not know what this is. I'm not sure what that's for. Pretty cool. That's kind of pretty. Okay. Put some apple crisp in that. I'd probably pot. like it even more. Bean pots don't sell that great, but. You like apple crisp? Yeah, I do. A lot. Hip and hop. Very done. And it's broken. Hip and hop is broken. What up? It's a 
pretty nice one. 1992, Boston Warehouse. Made in Taiwan. I don't think we'll get the bean pot. We should. You do, eh? We don't have one. Look at these birds for 550. These birdies. Yeah. Are you a doorstop? Oh, you're light. What the heck would that be from? 550. Oh. I don't know. Do you know? No. <laughs> that is definitely a colossal drink size. I know, I kind of want one. <laughs> We've got our, uh, what do you call those? Yeah, but this says you went to Sam and got a... A colossal... Big gulp. Big gulp. But what are those things we have? Those are big water things. No, no. Those silver things we take on vacation. Bubba cups? Bubba cups? Yeah, I think they're bubba cups. You don't Sorry, like Sorry, I was looking at this and thinking, I want to weigh my chips and eat them. Oh, well, look at this. Hey? Weigh your chips and eat them like that guy? <laughs> Oh, it's like a pepper grinder without the bottom. Missing the bottom. Oh, there's a 1050 for the tray. I know it's neat. It's this old tray here. 1050. And it's got some scratches. They always do usually when they've got the room on them. grinder or no coffee grinder sorry I meant coffee I was thinking about the pepper thing we just looked at mm -hmm. coffee grinder for 15 yeah I don't know <laughs> it's a flashlight. here's another one of these uh where people take plates and glue them to candle things and stuff. You know what? Is that real silver? EPMS. No, I don't think it is, but can you imagine if it was? PNG, sorry. No, that's not real silver. For a minute, I thought it might be. Let's go down here. Strawberry Street. Well, what else we got? Oh, and cute little booties. Oh my. There's piggies back here. Hey, this guy. Oh, a little rabbit. That's cute. <laughs> what are the piggies doing? Eating an ice cream? Cupcake? What is that? Cupcake? Yeah. In Korea. It was two Hayden Love Grams, Claudia. Oh, it's a penny bank. It's chipped. It's chipped. That guy's pretty uh, buff, isn't he? Get playing buff, the drums. Get buff <laughs> playing the drums. It's very in shape. Is your frame? This guy. Oh, cool. It's kind of interesting. I don't know if it's missing some things to what it was, or if it was the top of something. There's the mine cases. There's lots of mine cases in here. In Japan. Little singing nuns. Really? Little singing nuns. What's that? They're little, they're little nuns, or one singing, one spring. What's the last one doing? 
Oh, she's got a candle. Huh. I'm gonna search those ones up. $14.50 is probably too much, but. Ooh, kitty. Ooh, kitty mask. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that'd be fun for Halloween. Okay. Is that for all those like parties that people have? Discreet parties. <laughs> Parties we're not interested in going to. <laughs> the ones we're not going to. <laughs> That's funny. It's a good costume piece though. Okay. These kitties. They look a little rough. You've got a chick chin. And they've got some parts that are scratched off. Somebody was loving it too much. Somebody loved those kitties way too much. <laughs> Crystal candle holders. Flowers. I don't know how much they want. For the crystal candle holders. $5.50. They chipped or anything? Uh, whoops. Stickers everywhere down there. Hmm. What do you think of the flower? Crystal candle holders. So they did a lot of work on that one? On all of them. Yeah, they did, and then they just got rid of them, eh? Yep. Pantry. I love my kitty. Pantry. series handcrafted in Canada hmm but who would want that moose plaque do you think I would want that in my garage you would hey oh yeah for sure <laughs> I don't know I don't know about that this is quite the tray I would probably paint this part but for 1050 it wouldn't probably be worth my time to paint it at that feather art. Oh yeah. Kind of interesting, hey? Raccoon with the dollar dollar bag, money bags, six fifty. Somebody made a planter with a raccoon and a money bag. That's funny. <laughs> That's kind of a neat looking that teapot. That is a neat looking teapot. What does it say on the bottom? Oh, that is interesting. Hmm. It's right in the back, no one can see it. That is very interesting. 950 as is. Is it chipped? Is it very you gotta be six feet tall to see that. Yeah. It's hiding. It's cool. Okay, we're gonna search that one up. Put it carefully in the cart. <laughs> And we've got a bunch of creamers here. Grafton. It's a pretty color. Green. Oh, it's got a little flower inside. $8.50. That's another interesting looking teapot. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. It's very um, Majolica. A Majolica teapot. Interesting. Doesn't it, can you show me the bottom of it? I just want to see how warm. It's not looking very warm. It's usually a sign of age. But let's still look it up. Check it out. See if it's anything special. It's fine now the teapots that are hidden at the top. Oh look, a Santa creamer. Exclusive. It's very exclusive. But we got little tiny uh, espresso cups. Mm -hmm. Okay. Clown cup. Happy birthday. That's probably dollar store. Oh, a cracked Starbucks. I don't think anyone's gonna want a cracked Starbucks. IKEA! are pretty nice color right there. I've been liking a lot of Ikea stuff lately. Suspicious. <laughs> oh, 
That's cute. <laughs> Guess what it says? <laughs> Moby Dick. Nope. It's a saying. What does it say? Well, I have no idea. Mornings. Morning. Blow. <laughs> Mornings blow. Yeah, that's funny. Time with the thick rims like that, they're hard to drink out of. Yeah. But it's funny. You mix and match. Ooh, mix and match. I could use I could use some more coffee cups. What do we got here? Ride a cock horse to Banbury Cross. A cock horse. ABC. Why would they call it a cock horse? Why are they calling it a cock horse? That's where it goes, I guess. That's what they called them back in the day? Uh oh. Ban oh. Banbury Cross, two miles. That's like a tombstone. It's a very unusual cup. I don't understand. <laughs> Hang on with this cup. It's an escape from Alcatraz, Federal Penitentiary. <laughs> Funny. That is cool. Hey? I wonder if that's an old cup. Or if that's recent. Oh, I like all these cups that come from England have thin. They're thinner rimmed. And I like that a lot. I like drinking out of them. I'm gonna get this cup because I like it's got stuff in it. I'm gonna have to bleach it. <laughs> but it's got Skinny rims. That's what I like. So full, seven fifty. It's kind of a pretty rim on that bowl. These type bowls are so pretty, and they just don't really sell. You know? I mean, you can sell them online. Uh, that's a pretty one. Your grandma had this pattern. I think your grandma had this pattern. She might have. Mm, I'm pretty sure she did. I faintly remember using those dishes when she was around still. There's some elegant looking dishes down here. Oh, gravy boat. Tahoe. Contemporary Noritake. How much do they want? The Noritake. Oh, there's a whole bunch of pieces. Oh, my nose just started to run. It's kind of pretty, hey? Simple and light. Well, I don't see what it says the price. There's a bunch of plates. Two, four, six, eight, ten plates. Fifty-five they want for it. Fifty-five for the whole set. Of Noritake. Huh. Cute corn plates. They're cute. Yes. Hey. Uh, fresh vegetables. They're kind of cute. They make me think of like a hoedown. I'm gonna guess these are German. Oh no! They're not German. U.S. patent. Blue Danube. Blue Danube? Is that what that says? Danube? Can you zoom in? Is it zoomed in? <laughs> no, it's really blurry. Oh, no? How about now? I'm trying, I'm trying. How about now? <laughs> Hang on. Did it say Danube? I can't see it. Even if it was. Okay, since so it's a Danube, a Danube set. It says Danube? I think so. D U N U N U B E. D U D A N U B E. Good. Yeah. Bunch of pink glass up here. 11.50. Yeah, for 11.50, I wouldn't make a whole lot on that. I'm liking this jar for Q-tips. I don't think it's old. I just like how it looks. Hey? Mm -hmm. Put your Q-tips in there on your uh, on your tray. Remember the tray I bought the other day? Stick this on the tray. That looks oh, yeah. sweet. It's 
So you visit. I don't know what That's it like is. It's like a nut. Kind of. A puppet. No? What does it say on the back? It does. It says puppet. Puppet on a stick. Put your finger in there. No. <laughs> Reminding Mike of our little girls when they were little, and they're not little anymore. What do we got here? Smiley face penny bank without the bottom. This is a lot of action in this place. What about this guy down here? What? Oh, he's thinking. He is Abbott Canada 72950. He's got chips. Hmm. Interesting. He's got chips, so I, I don't think I'm going to I might look him up. But... Old decanter here. What is this? After school? That's, that's their wine glass for when they're done school. Maybe that's the teacher's wine glass. Maybe. <laughs> Decanter here. Picture just makes me want to go to Cuba. That's what that picture does. Oh. I want to go back to Cuba, and that's a very cool old scooter. It's a Vespa. A Vespa? Yeah, very I want, cool. I would like a Vespa. Will me you too. give me a Vespa? Yeah, I'll get us both Vespas. Sweet. <laughs> oh, let's go to Cuba with our Vespa and take our own pictures. Okay. I bet you we could rent a Vespa there. What do you think? Probably. I bet we could. Christmas. Well, now's the time to look at it when no one else is interested in it. Have a look. I had a cookie jar like that. My sister-in-law gave it to me. What else we got here for Christmas? It's kind of a pretty wreath. Doesn't seem right looking at Christmas right now, does it? That's a really pretty wreath down there too. That's so cool. Treasure Island. More for more for animals. What is it supposed to be though? I don't know. That's made out of real. Yeah, I know. Fur. What's the nose made out of? I don't know. E. I don't is know. Real that. Animal stuff? Ew, don't say that. Yeah. I gotta think I think it is crazy. It's, no. It's got whiskers and everything. Really? Yeah. I oh, think that's a little... Don't tell me that because it's like tiny, like it's a, a baby. It's a little it can't something. Be. It is? Yeah. That, no, really? Yes. That's why it has mushrooms on it? That would be my guess. That, was like, that looks like a mid-century modern type teapot. Are you sure it's for mushroom tea? Some I'm looking it up. Some... See the fish uh, spoon and fork thing here? What? Look at the spoon in the. That's like for salad, maybe? Oh, that's cool. Is that for salad? I would say, yeah. That's interesting. How much do they want? 25? Fish salad? Mariposa. Mariposa. Huh. Yeah, see, these guys are cool, too. I spotted these Fire King Milk Glass Fit Rock Salt and Pepper Shakers. I love the large size, and they wanted $25. And at $25, if I decided to sell them, I probably could make 10 to $20. I just ended up buying them for myself because I really liked them. That's definitely not salt. Mm. Yeah, I'll take those. I had a look at the mushroom uh, teapot for cups and cream and sugar. I really like them. Uh, it's $60 for the whole group. You probably could make a little bit of money. I just decided for that price that if they ended up sitting, they would take up a lot of room in my booth. And to sell them online, I just didn't feel like that was enough room. I'm all excited, but it's 50 the polka dots. There's one here with roses on it. How much is it? Care about the nuns. Uh, guess how many think? guess how many nuns I want. How many? None. <laughs> You're silly. Look at the cookie cup. <laughs> somebody's somebody's uh, hobbyist piece. 
this uh, coffee grinder. It's not actually, I don't know if that's actually old or not. Somebody painted it, and yes, I think it is actually. They painted it and put chickens and roosters. Keep finding teeth. It's got armor on it. It does have armor. Oh, look at that. That's interesting. Hmm. Look at these ballerinas. I'm good. <laughs> Does that scare you? <laughs> yes. It's that crank thing at the top there. Yeah. Don't know. You crank it, but there's no holes in the bottom. Huh, I have no idea. I kind of like this pepper grinder. It's kind of neat. Five fifty. Hmm. Have to look it up. Put it there. I'm noticing that this part comes off, and you could paint this white and recover the seat because I think the seats come off. Yeah, you could easily recover these. Oh, I don't know if I can leave them behind. It's only two, that's the thing. But, but they'd I... be cool accent chairs, is what I'm thinking. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? They're pretty cool looking. They look kind of cool looking. White. Okay, I'm taking the chairs. Oh, perfect. And my husband was kind enough to buy me the polka dotted bowl. He bought it for me for Valentine's Day. And if I decide to sell, which I would never, but if I did, I'd probably make some money off it. <laughs> so, thank you. You're welcome. And the salt and pepper shakers, those are awesome. I might keep those too. You're funny. <laughs> the teapots, the one teapot, I have no idea if it's, uh, I don't know. The Majolica one I think I'll sell online because I think uh, it would do better online than sitting in my booth. But I might try yeah. both. I might put it in my booth and then if it doesn't sell my booth, I'll put it online. But that other teapot, it just looks really cool. I mean, it might not be anything at all. I don't know. Gross. So we're going to head over to Value Village. Value Village is right close to here, so it's not going to take us long to get there. It's usually where I shopped. I had no idea there was a Goodwill here. When I Googled it, it never said there was a good Goodwill here, and she said it's been here for two years. Huh? Who knew? Okay, we're at Value Village, and it's getting dark out. It's going to be scary. <laughs> this whole thrifting at night is different. Kind of people. Yeah, a whole different crowd. Right. The night owls. <laughs> the sneaky ones. This place is way less busy than the Goodwill. Just waiting for Mike to get me a cart. <laughs> and we're off. Okay. Let's see. I like, I'm gonna look on this side because this is where the pirates would probably be if there was any pirates in here. Come on, show me the pirates. How much do they want for this little 650? It's got a lid, so that's kind of nice. Well, I kind of like that it has a lid. You might get a little more for it because it has a lid. I'll think about it because. Just let me put this in the cart, would you? What's the bear there? It's a bear for honey. Oh yeah, it's got the stick. Wooden fish here for five ninety nine. Sweet. Okay. Put a slob of fish on that. Six dollars. <laughs> it's for people that uh, eat a lot of fish. There's a good chance this isn't water. <laughs> That's funny. I like it. That's something you would have seen the bad moms in that movie. They'd yeah. have a water bottle like that. Well, have a quick glance for some old uh, beaters. See any old beaters? Beaters? Yeah, beaters. Yeah, mixing beaters. Look at this. Two. Two. Are those 
drinking glasses? Really? That wasn't like something for like, I don't think the glasses are meant to be what they are. Yeah, those are like whiskey glasses, aren't they? Huh. Brandy, whiskey, something like that. Interesting. What else do we have in here? It's not too busy in here right now, so that's nice. What do you, what do we have here? Oh, what's this? A little, um, it's a little chick. Maxwell Williams, the days of Christie. It's a cute little gravy with a chick on it and a pear. Hey? Mm-hmm. $8. $8 for that. A, oh, it's a partridge in a pear tree. Ah, it's it a is, partridge. It is in a pear tree. <laughs> it's a partridge in a pear tree. That's funny. I thought it was a chick and a pear, but it's partridge in a pear tree. I'm allowed to be blonde sometimes. Am I not? That's good. It happens to the best of us. I saw somebody with the happy face mug going around. Look at that. Orange. 1974. It's a nice cake stand. $14.99. This is a nice cake stand. It's kind of purpled. You know when glass starts to purple? It's older. I might think about that one. So before 1910, I think it's 1910, there was, oh, is it kind of scratched? I'm gonna have to look at this one better because I'm noticing scratching on the glass. Could be scratched. Just, <laughs> just having a drink? <laughs> well, what's this? This is, I'm always drawn to this color. Oh, yes, it's pretty. Very nice color. Loud. Oh, look what I found. That's cool. That is $5.49. Hmm. Is it in good condition? Looks good eye. Take it and go. Found a scratch. So you're going back. That's why you were sitting there all in your glory and nobody took you. All three kitties in a basket. And their tails are squished. Main Taiwan. Three kitties in a basket. Swan. That is a cute little swan. You can put a plant in that. It's a puppy. Oops, be careful. It's a little puppy. For six dollars. What are you playing with? Just these guys. Oh, oh careful. <laughs> I like them. Like like okay. Oh, I'm seeing his front and back legs now. <laughs> okay. Hang them on the wall. Hat. <laughs> Cows next door. Yeah, <laughs> that's true. We live beside the cows. Tortoise show, I think that's called. Five ninety nine. What is this? I don't know. I think somebody glued that all together. I'm guessing. That is fancy. Asparagus plate. That's kind of cute. It's like crazy. <laughs> my hair just stuck to my eyelash. <laughs> Music got a little loud here, but here's an Indiana glass gondola bowl. It has wear on the bottom. No good. 
seahorse. Somebody made him. Oh, whoopsie. Which is cute. And he made that. Did you see the creamer? We've got a real cow theme going on here. Oh, is this another? It is. What are you a pepper. <laughs> It's so worn. I would get it. But it's kind of worn. Look at these bowls. That takes you back. Okay? Mm -hmm. To the 70s. Gonna have a party. Look at that. $24.99. Okay. Mm. Yeah, you just, it's like you take it with you to your party yeah. and then it flips open. There's some records. Yeah. I wonder if that's worth anything. Want a, a wabbit light, Mike? Yeah, that's a really cool light. <laughs> well, I think we're done because I don't see them bringing out any more carts. Ended up buying the purpling cake stand. Right, it is dark out and we are done thrifting for the day. I bought the early American press glass for $14.99. It's got a tiny scratch on the top, but I couldn't leave it behind. This one might do well online. Might be able to get 80 for it with the scratch, maybe a little bit more, we'll see. Or you could bake a cake for or me. Or I could keep it and put a cake on it because it's purpling, you can't see it right now, but it's purpled, which is so cool. That's it. You guys, we are done and we are going to find some food. We are going to eat what? What are we I'm gonna eat? I'm not sure, double Big Mac maybe. <laughs> Head home and we're gonna stay awake because we're wide awake from all the coffee. <laughs> <laughs> Why? <laughs> because we had too much coffee and we shouldn't have drank it. <laughs> Take care everyone, until right. next time. Be sure to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified. For more thrifting and DIY at Original Adventures 71, thanks for watching.